Hello friends, Arslan here. In this video, I want to show you a IMO approved GPS. It is from NSR. It is touch screen GPS suitable for the ocean going vessels, whether you need a GPS on board an oil tanker or whether you need a GPS on board a general cargo vessel. The box, the complete set consists of the main unit, the antenna and the antenna cable. And very soon we are planning to take it on board and fix it on board an oil tanker. Their existing GPS is having fault and they want us to, they want us to, to fix a new GPS on board their vessel. Then another product I have is that this is NMEA buffer from AEP. What is the purpose of this buffer unit is that normally on board a vessel they they supposed to have two GPS and uh, the data of the GPS is going to all the equipments like egg disk, radars, etc. So what this product, the purpose of this product is that it will take input from the two GPS and then it will distribute it to all the equipment which requires GPS position. And in case of uh, if, if any issues comes with any of the GPS, it will automatically switch it over. You know, some of the ships, they don't know that the GPS position coming to the egg disk or radar where it is coming. So in case if they have problem, the GPS position disappear from all the equipment. So make sure you have a system on board that all your equipment must be connected to both of the GPS, GPS 1 and GPS 2 and it has to be connected in a way using one of these devices that in case you have a fault in one of the GPS, it will switch automatically to another GPS. Now it's time to go on board. Removing the old GPS and preparing to fix the new NSR GPS. Okay, hello friends, my name is Cosmos Chinedu. I work with Falcon Terra Axis Limited. We are into ship navigation equipment. Yeah, uh, friends, I want to show you something very important. We just uh, installed a new equipment called GPS, NSR GPS. It's very interesting that you can see it's a touch screen that from you can from here you select anything and you can see the satellite view. You can see as much data is picking from a different satellite. So here you can see the compass aspect. It also have the you can also see the highway, hello, so many every option you need is here. So now we from here you also we interface it to all other equipment you have, they have that is on board which include the egg disk you can see on the egg disk we interface it with the egg disk the position is here on the vhf radio also you can see it's interfaced to it likewise the radar is also interfaced on the radar clearly you can see the position is coming and also on this uh, ship they have another gps which is gps2 which they are using so we have to do it in a such a way <coughs> that both of the gps are interfaced such that you can decide which one you want to use per time so either gps1 or gps2 like this one is gps1 that one is gps2 so if i switch off this one automatically you will notice that the data automatically will be out everywhere but we have a, a unit whereby you can now select between the gps1 and gps2 and that one if you look carefully now on the display you can see the error has come because the nav input has gone because we should switch it off it's off from all the place but this one is the gps2 this one automatically will now feed 
the entire system so let me show you where it is it is kept at this point you can make your decision where you want to choose which is we are now going back to the second dps which is the one that is on remember we have switched off the other one i want to show you how it works now now look at initially it was given an alarm now it is has, has come back it has transferred back to gps2 so it's as simple as that now i also want to show you that on the other place the gps1 is still switched off we have not powered it on but everywhere has received data because it has already been completely done now watch out we switch it back on so at this point both of them are available for use at any point you don't have to be afraid oh my one of my gps is not working no some of my equipment will not be working no 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 we do it in such a way that both of them will interplay each other depending on whichever you want them to be on automatic mode automatically select anyone you want to be in priority and so on and so forth so that is all my friends i appreciate you call us anytime any anytime we will be there at your service thank you very much